Um, just to advise you that the business owner, uh, if you step foot on that sidewalk there, which they do own, uh, he'll have you arrested for trespassing. Welcome back to We The People University. My name is Abaya Israel, former police officer, former sheriff's deputy. Today's YouTube channel is brought to you by a channel by the name of the Western Missouri Variety. If you have not subscribed to his channel, please make sure you show support and go and do so. Today, the Kansas City Police Department located in Missouri has made the highlight reel. This video is just gonna help prove what I've been saying for a long time, that police are not taught the law inside of the academy. Now, as a lot of you already know, and I see it in the comment section quite often, that the police academy is only six months. But what some of you may not know, that a lot of police academies here in Georgia are only three months. So why am I pinpointing that? Well, a lot of police officers are walking away from the profession. And so in order to keep those spots filled, you must get officers through the academy faster. The problem with that is this. Simple laws like public and private property are not taught in the academy. And simple things like this lead to citizens being falsely arrested, citizens being falsely detained, and having hours, if not days, taken away from their life that they can never get back. In this video, we're gonna deal with a situation dealing with a private sidewalk. Can you walk down a private sidewalk if the owner tells you that you can't? Let's check out the video and we'll dissect more later. So, looks like uh, Kansas City Police Department just rolled up. So, we're going to see what they have to say. Yep, what's up? What's going on today? Somebody called on you, so that's all the only reason we're here. Yeah, oh, I'm sure. I'm sure they did. What's going on? Yeah. I'm just, just videotaping. Videotaping. What's your name? Stone. You got it on camera? Yeah. Okay. Now I do. Okay. Yeah. Good. So what's going on? I'm just videotaping. I'm just wondering what they said to you before they called us. Oh, they didn't say anything to me. We were just, I was just talking to them. I, I asked them a couple questions about marijuana. I'm going to go talk uh, to them real quick. So. Yeah. Okay. That was it. Yeah. Well, you're on a public sidewalk. I mean, I don't know. They didn't tell me to leave or anything. Okay. But still, I mean, well, they called us and yeah, said there's nothing going on. Was taking pictures and it sounded like they already talked to you and asked you to leave or something. But no, my partner's going to talk. Well, I mean, even if they would have asked me to leave, I'm still on a public sidewalk. Yeah, I don't know. You're not on their property, so. I mean, that sidewalk over there is actually part of the public sidewalk, despite whether or not they put it in. Yeah, despite whether they put that in there or not. Um, regardless of whether they put that in there, the public can walk down that, can walk down there. Hey, Philly, as long as you're not doing anything to the property or causing any nuisance, nah. I don't care. Uh -uh. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Thanks. Not causing any nuisance. Yeah. I was just asking well, them some, like I was just asking them some questions and okay. they decided, uh, they decided not to talk to me anymore. And then what, what, yeah, I was asking them some questions about their product. That was it, um, you know, just because it's kind of confusing, you know. So, you know, they, ha they have all kinds of different strengths of THC. So, so when you talk to the uh, police department, who, who have you talked to? Oh, I was trying to talk to them about, because uh, I was kind of doing a little story about um, the uh, several burglaries that went on uh, at... Yeah, there was a there was two or three here. One on Prospect, one out on Bannister. Yeah. You know, there was a few. Yeah, there was a few different burglaries. So you know. You guys doing a shooting a promo today, or? Well, we're just here because we had Oh, oh, you're. Oh, they called nine one one over it. Actually, yeah, that's why we're here. Nine one one. Nine one one. You're kidding. No. Why didn't they just call the non-emergency number? Maybe they did. I don't know. I mean, we just get dispatched on a call. I don't know if it came in 911 or not. Oh my goodness! Oh man! Yeah, it was in regard to you. So. Yeah. Well, it doesn't appear to be an emergency. Well, it's 
You never know these hey. days, right? Hey, I'm off to trial better. Hello. Uh, I'm just to advise you that the business owner, uh, if you step foot on that sidewalk there, which they do own, uh, he'll have you arrested for trespassing. I've spoken that, with him. That's he, that's an that's a. Let me finish. I've spoken with him. He's given me that authority. He said that once it's done, if you step back on their property, that will happen. No questions asked. You'll go to jail for trespassing. Okay? Please don't go back on their property. Please, with all due respect. Do not go back on their property. So second, you're second. So you're telling second, me sir. you're telling second, second, you're telling. Secondly, sir, have this officer gotten your information? No. I'm not giving any information today. I haven't done anything illegal. So here's the question: If the sidewalk is indeed a private sidewalk, can the owner of that sidewalk stop the public from using a private sidewalk? Let's look at this. Burmeister versus Howard. This is a case that was decided in 1867. This court has not departed from the rule established in this case that the fee in the public street or highway remains in the owner of the abutting land and the public acquires only the right of passage with powers and privileges necessarily imply in the grant of the easement. A public right of way, AKA public passage is a public right to travel unhindered over a piece of land even if the land is privately owned. Generally, this term is in reference to sidewalks and streets that are located on city or town property. So let's understand, there are private sidewalks, there are private streets, and just because there is an easement, that does not make it public property. What is public property? Government properties consist of land assets owned by federal, state, or local governments, and may also include government agencies, or government-sponsored organizations such as libraries or parks. Government-owned property refers to land or other assets that are legally owned by a government or a government entity. Government-owned property may be titled at the federal, state, or local level and may or may not allow unrestricted public access. Some government-owned properties constitute public goods such as parks, libraries, roads, and sidewalks. An easement is the right to use someone else's land for your benefit. This would be private property. One property is usually benefited and the other property burdened by an easement. Easements can be public or private or positive or negative. A public easement is a special type of property ownership. When an easement exists on a piece of land, the owner of that land must permit others to use the easement for the stated purpose. If the easement is a public easement, the person who owns the land must allow members of the public to access the defined areas of his land for reasons stated in the easement. So as we see, when it all boils down, it simply comes to this. Private sidewalk or public sidewalk, there is a public right of passage that that business must allow this man or anybody of the public to use. Again, this is not taught in the academy. So in return, this will cause a huge inconvenience to a taxpayer. What questions do you have? That is a public sidewalk over there. The public can walk down that sidewalk. That'll be a debate that you can have in court if you step on their property, okay? Do you have any other questions? That's a public sidewalk. I don't have I don't have any other questions except myself clear. I don't have any other questions except that is a public sidewalk. Myself clear to you what's going to occur if you step on their property. Yes or no? What, what's, what's going on is that have is the I public. I made myself clear what is going to happen okay. if you step on their property, let me, sir. Let me, yes or no? Let me let you know something. That's a public sidewalk. Yes or no? Is all I need. I don't need to answer that question. Okay. But that is, that is a public sidewalk. And you want me to tell you something? Pardon me? That's not a public sidewalk. You're saying it's not a public sidewalk? Sir, you don't need to be involved. I've stated to him. I, I, I appreciate you. I've let him know what's going to occur if he does that. So. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, well, you know what? I'm going to do some more investigation on that, and I'll check that out. I'm talking to him, trying to find out what's going on. I didn't even ask for his info. Okay. What I'll do is I'll check that out, and and I'll pull all the records on that. Okay. And I'll done. and I'll and I'll, there, and I'll find out whether that's a public sidewalk or not. No, I don't. He was, he was and, asking me something though about down. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Since this doesn't. You're violating his privacy by doing thing. that. No, I'm not. Well, this is a separate thing. This is, this is, this is a public it. sidewalk. If you guys want privacy, you need, you need to make it on your own. Okay? 
Thanks for coming out and thanks for coming out and keep safe. Okay, keep safe, y'all. Okay, so this is the Kansas City, Missouri Police Department saying that that is not a public sidewalk. We will find more information out about that to verify. Again, remember, it's not so much if it's public or private. The emphasis lies on the right of passage for the public. The link to this full video is down below. Make sure you go over, check out the entire video, and subscribe. Also remember, when police come out of the academy, they have not learned the law. So it is up to you to learn the law and also to know your rights. So your rights are not violated by super tyrants like the one in this video. With that being said, We The People University, signing off.